Hi and welcome back to another Tech Minds video. Now in this video, we'll take a look at the Chai Erda TC18. It's a compact handheld transceiver, which is suitable for a range of services. Now in the box, we get the usual contenders, a desktop charger, a wrist strap, a belt clip, a manual, and of course the radio itself. Now the battery is removable and can be charged separately from the radio using the supplied desktop charger. Now the battery can also be charged through the radio via a USB-C cable. Now, unfortunately, there is no USB-C cable in the box, but obviously these are cheap on Amazon or eBay if you need to get one. The TC18 supports FRS, GMRS, PMR, and ham radio, all in one little radio. And that's because it has a frequency coverage of between 400 to 480 megahertz. Now on the left side of the radio, we find a PTT and two function buttons, which can be reprogrammed in software. On the right hand side, there's a speaker mic connection, which also doubles up as a programming port. And the cable was not supplied with mine, but I just use one of those multi radio USB programming cables, which are found cheap on Amazon and I've shown before in previous videos. You will also notice a USB-C port. Now this is for charging the battery. The USB-C port is on the radio itself rather than the battery. So if you want to recharge the battery via USB-C, then you have to have the battery installed into the radio while charging. Now, interestingly enough, on the front of the radio where the microphone and speaker is, you'll also find another PTT button, quite a large round button, which has a ring LED around it. When it glows red, it means you're transmitting, and when it's receiving, it turns green. So yep, this radio has two PTT buttons. I guess it's all about how you want to hold or use the radio. Now within software, each memory channel, which there are 16 of, can have the transmit and receiver frequency set differently, if required. And along with CTCSS or DCS settings for encoding or decoding, the TC18 can then be used through ham radio repeaters, or at least on the 70 centimeter band. Now for us in the UK, we would normally set the radio to FM wide for use with repeaters on the 70 centimeters, but in software, you can also change this to narrow if required. Now the transmit power is also adjustable and according to the specification, a power setting of high would set the radio to transmit with two watts output, while with the lower power setting, the output would be 500 milliwatts. Now with its built-in and non-removable antenna, along with the 500 milliwatt power setting, this makes the TC18 suitable for use on the UK PMR band. Now I'm not sure on the restrictions with regards to equipment when it comes to FRS or GMRS. Maybe someone from the States can confirm what restrictions there are in the comments below. Now let's take a quick listen to see what the audio sounds like when transmitting using this radio. For this test, I'll just set my SDR receiver to the same frequency as the radio. This is the TC18 Chai Erda TC18, just testing the audio quality. This is the Chai Erda TC18, testing audio quality. Microphone is to the right of the speaker. To the right of the speaker, the Chai Erda TC18 talking about two inches away from the microphone. Now, as this radio does not have a removable antenna or an external antenna connection, I cannot connect this directly to my Spectrum Analyzer. But one of the great things about the Tiny SA Ultra is that it comes with a little telescopic antenna. With this connected to the RX port, I was able to take a spurious emissions test while transmitting. Now, as you can see here, the second harmonic is around 55 dB down from that fundamental which in my books makes this a nice little clean radio. Now, as mentioned earlier, this radio can be programmed to work through ham radio repeaters. So I programmed in my local repeater on 70 centimeters. Unfortunately, there was no activity, but I managed to open it. Also while scanning around, there was a couple of users using channel one of the PMR band. I believe these transmissions are coming from some kennels around a mile away from my location. Anyway, 
Hi guys, that's a Chai Erda TC18. Just a small little radio that you could chuck in your backpack. Not the normal kind of ham radio bells and whistles that we normally see, but I thought it was worth showing. Anyway, until the next video, take care, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video.